Hey everyone, Chef. Terraformers, there's gonna be a uh, fan noise in the background today. I don't know how badly it's gonna come through, but you're gonna you're gonna hear it. It is a hot one today. It is going to be a hot one, probably for the rest of the week. So it's just gonna be uh it's gonna be the state of things up here, unfortunately. We are down to and I really love sp I think I buy like a space game for this one. We are on Blue Planet, difficulty forty five. We are looking at terraforming parameters primarily. And I kind of like the idea of rushing out some early bacteria. We'll see how it goes. We're pretty well positioned here for like a science setup early on. We've got silicate nitrate. It's going to let us get down an early lab or two. And maybe we can uh, make some things work from there. So let's get it going. Oh yeah, we start with trade routes. That's right. We have an interesting large hint of tritium to start. I'm actually not going to do this project right off the bat. I'm going to wait. And I'm going to wait because I think that having tritium for generators is going to be more important than basically anything else. The blue planet scenario is very, very power heavy. We want to build a ton of generators. We want to build a ton of uh, gas factories. We want to build all that kind of stuff. And I think having extra tritium around to make that happen is going to be really valuable for us. Get like some early labs down, start working our way towards a bacteria spreader. I, I simply don't have the income to really trade for anything right now. I guess maybe what I should do is like take one of you and turn it into one of you to get to this generator faster. But that's about it, and I definitely need a robot hub here. Ah, uh, we need titanium now, actually. I think I need to do something like that. And then... Honestly, send it. I gotta, I gotta get this down, I wanna get this tritium mine, I wanna get this nitrates mine. Let's make it happen. We'll take a third one of you. That's the last one we should have to take for a while. Grab me one of these guys, get me closer to five in case we find uh, a second lab blueprint come through and then we've got a small hit of titanium down here. So you can go to six, start bringing in some more tritium. Robot hub will be able to go down next turn. I would happily take a second lab. I would like a hint of nitrates here if I could find it. So like that would be pretty good. And then all of these are pretty much the same cost, so give me the one that comes with titanium. You can go... I guess like here. Doesn't really matter. I would happily take the minus one penalty on that. And now I'm going to need eight titanium. Switch me over to this so that I can build one of these next turn. And then we'll get back on titanium. And I also think I could probably get off of tuber farm. Or I, I think I could get off of um, nitrates for labs now and get onto something like a tuber farm. Especially because we're going to have one per turn. So I will take extra titanium happily. We're at seven. Can't quite make both of these mines work. I think I would rather have the nitrates coming in earlier. You can come here. You're going to be at four. I do want to get this third generator down immediately. So I'm going to leave this set up as is. And we have almost exhausted our power already, which is pretty unfortunate. But you're only four support. You're not that good for six science and eight power. In fact, none of these are that good. I'm going to turn that into science. All right. So you can chill for a little bit. And I think I'm just going to keep doubling down on tritium. And I will explore for nitrate to get this tuber farm up. So we can start to think about a little bit more expansion. That site is not the most exciting thing I've ever seen. That one is even worse. I don't really care about either of those right now. Improved space flight is not really something I'm feeling. Improved robotics is always just kind of fine. Advanced city planning is also just kind of fine. 
I think I'll take improved robotics, get a little bit of a refund back. Give me a greenhouse farm. You can start coming in here. We'll satellite our way way up here for some nitrates. That'll get us a tuber farm. And then do we have any tritium hints or anything? No. We have a silicate, which would let us get like a resonance station faster. Maybe we should start thinking about that. We can export one food at this point. Six, seven, eight, nine. I only need to do one of those. Um, and then I guess we'll start saving power. And then after we finish that, let me do this for just like one turn. And then after we finish that, I think we could start working on orbital ring. But we've got a pretty good jump on our power production. I would take another robot hub at this point over the courthouse. Courthouse isn't going to do a ton in this city, as is. So we can do one. We can do two. And that'll be it. So, problems to solve. We already probably want to start thinking about a second city. We just don't quite know where it's going to go yet. That's pretty uninspiring. We also just kind of want to grab terraforming projects relatively soon. I mean, like, the worst case, we can found this city. It's not bad. It's not amazing, but it's not bad. It's a crater, which is okay. Earthworks? No, not really. Not really. Not really. I think just having more science projects is probably good enough, and Eureka's kind of fine in the early game. A trade route's kind of fine in the early game. Although I, I don't have space to build a Marsha, actually. We're basically saving food and water for city number two at this point. So give me a landing pad. And I would just... I would like to find city founding locations, basically. I'd like something that looks not horrible. Otherwise, I will just resort to this city and fill it full of terraforming buildings as soon as we start seeing them. Early Research Center... Seems pretty good. Resonant station seems pretty good. I'm happy to take that. I would also like to take silicates to get us closer to that resonant station at this point. Can I get any happiness that also has silicates? No. Alright, well, satellite your way way down here. At least get your water for a city. And then Solus, very cold. Tharsis, not that cold. What about Samaria Minor? Pretty cold. But a nice natural site. We could have a nice house, house, house configuration in there. This isn't bad. We have a nitrate mine. We have a water within two. We have a sandstone. I think this is probably fine. It's, it's none water. So we finish one water project and we can grow trees there. I think that's okay. I'll settle for it, at a minimum. Give me cyanophyta, give me a tuber farm. We're looking for a soil factory now, get this resonance station down. I think we need to build one more house here. Or we could get like a delivery drone, just to make the numbers work. And then finish up the rest of these explorations. We're also at 14 science. I kind of want to get a bacteria spreader down early. So let's do this. We'll found this city next turn. That rich soil is also really nice. And then we'll, uh, like, satellite here, robot hub, bacteria spreader, and an empty tile somewhere. Hopefully this will be a good empty tile for it. And I guess just a second robot hub? Ten power. Never gonna say no to that. So found city. You go here. We get a nice plus four out of it. Satellite next turn. Yeah, fine. And then let's see. Boom, boom, boom. Put a robot hub back here. It also clears the way for a little bit of food. Wouldn't mind doing a little export there now that we don't have to worry about the resonant station. We are going to need a second power configuration here. It'll probably get that, that quad spot. And then we'll have room for a terraforming building here and here. 
but that's our first two terraforming buildings at least. And then you can get back on this. And we're good to go. I think I'd actually rather save food than silicate right now. And then we start taking CO2 factories. So nail this. It's a gigantic hint. All right, we got to get a city down over there. That's too good to pass up. You come here. Empty tile. Bacteria spreader. We're miles away from that rich soil. So I guess we take the sandstone. Just to get the support. We'll chill at minus two for a while. And then show me a good city spot out here. I know it's cold. Promethea is even worse. Maybe not just minor will be fine and we could find something out there. But gigantic titanium. Silicate. Tritium. Canyon view. Double waters. A train. If this is like a city, a train station would go crazy in that spot. That's all I'm saying. Could also do a second robot hub in Senzini. Like here. And then we can get landing pad square and then an empty square. That's also not terrible. I'll do it. There. Now we've got a little bit of wiggle room to play around with. Now if you turn one of these off, turn this on. I just want this to go down next turn. I think I'm fine throwing all this out. You come here. Turn you off, turn you on. Turn you off. I don't really want to do science. Give me one here. And give me one here. Okay. Hold. It's good enough. That's good enough. Alright, that's going to be city number two. That is plenty good enough. We'll get a gigantic titanium out of it. We'll get a canyon out of it. We've got a nice little grow spot here. We can go... Uh, let's see, how would it work? We'd go farm, soil factory, farm, soil factory, farm, farm. I guess. I don't know. We can work it out, but it's good enough. That's the important part. Minus 28. It's a lot. I'm not going to lie. You're a large tritium deposit. Yeah, that city spot owns. All right, so we need water. And that's about it. We also have a ton of spare tritium that we can just burn on this project right away. I might also want to stop and just do a house. Like here. Because our support is a little scary. Is my primary worry. This is 100% a Eureka turn. We get terraforming parameters, we get eco homes, and we get a soil factory. You couldn't ask for a better Eureka turn than that. And then I need uh, I need titanium to get this thing down. Can I find titanium anywhere right now? No. E. All right, can I find nitrate then to get a soil factory down? Oh wait, there's titanium up here and it has nitrate attached to it. Yeah. All right, so turn you down, turn you up, get to nine. Throw out three food. And that's fine for next turn. It's going to let you play the CO2 factory. Which will go here. Yeah. And then you can also play the house next turn. That'll be nice. And then for 23 silicates, you could play a luxury workshop. You know, you might need to. You may not like to, but you may need to. I can't afford to explore this turn. So I think what we're going to do is play CO2 factory. Here. That gives us no support. It doesn't actually accomplish anything. It has to go here, and we don't have the power to have it go there. We take five science for sure. You're a filler building. You can just go there. 
so we'll see more projects. Turn you back on. Uh, and then I guess we're going to have to wait until a couple turns from now to do the rest of this stuff with these buildings. But at least we've got a lot of terraforming parameters moving, and it's relatively early on. Increases climate zones radiation. It's possible that we could make you work. So I think a development center is really good. I would love to be able to take more than one project per turn. I think a marsh is also really good. I think a robot hub is really good. I think a controlled nuclear meltdown is something I could build. And I think a man-machine co-op is something that I don't really care about. So I think I Eureka that turn as well, honestly. Just to be just to be honest with you, I think I Eureka that turn. And then next turn I can build Soil Factory. I can get close to an eco home. I could do like a hint of science to get an eco home. Uh, I really need to do water though to get this city up here because I need this titanium mine to go up. It would be really, really nice to get that titanium mine up. And then let's also start in on you. Henry's not horrible here. Removing a rock provides a titanium, fine. Silicates to titanium, fine. Sewage treatment, fine. But import CO2 is just like a nice fallback. I don't think I'm going to have the support to do mine venting, but efficient mines is really nice if we're going to be thinking about building that giant titanium mine. So let's get Henry in here. Let's satellite a large hint of water. How cheap are you? Three? I will simply explore you. Let's found you. Let's enable you. Let's build our soil factory. Then we need to satellite something. What do we need right now? We need titanium right now. We need to get this robot hub built or this marsha so that we can get this titanium deposit. So I think we need to satellite pretty much exactly you. And then what do you take? You're gonna be at 23 water anytime soon? No, as good as it would be to put it on that fertile soil, no. But are you going to build anything else in here faster? Yeah, you're going to build robots. They refund. And then where's a tile that I could stick this thing on? Here. I can do a controlled nuclear meltdown in Promethea, because I'm never going to put a city here. I'm just going to expand in it. So Blue Scopulus. The next house I build in Blue Scopulus is going to expand here. And I'm going to put a controlled nuclear meltdown on it. Donley Lab. I'd rather have a, three, a free 50 support, I think. Just to make sure I'm staying alive. You have to take a terraforming building. You're at 17 water, though. Or zero water. You need to be at 17. You could also just, like, take a lab. You don't have an anomaly. It was you that had the anomaly. So it's 23 resources for two science per turn. I have no timeline for building this. Yeah, I think I do have to take the lab. And then build it this turn? Where are you going to build it? Here. Yeah. There you go. And then you have none explorations left, but that's fine because you can just import CO2. Get your terraforming parameters up. And then this will not complete. So give me a little something like this until it balances out. And then export... Something like that, just to keep it balanced. Would love to take methanogenium. Would love to take a bus station. But would also love to take a tritium thermal generator. What's more important? 
You have two robots in hand. You're chronically short on power. You're right. When you're right, you're right. All right, let's get on this titanium or uh, this tritium, because we know where it's going to go in here. Oh, so close. So we do this. We get 16 next turn. We'll be at 20 in two turns. Don't export science. You want to build this development center in two turns. And then you have to throw something out. You're not going to build this luxury workshop, realistically. Be honest with yourself. I think you take a CO2 factory. I think you're happy to see it. I think you put this bad boy down. You start planning your controlled nuclear meltdown. You are exclusively looking for tritium still. So grab some of that. And then can you find any way up north? No, it's all titanium up there. Oh, there's some down here. Grab some of that. I'll take a free 10 food. I'm fine with that. And now you have all the trade routes in the world to play with. So get to six, get your robot hub ready. You'll be at nine on power. You also want to get your development center up, so I guess get one one more of those in. And then burn all your silicates off. What are you going to do with them? Nothing in your hand costs silicates right now. Keep the rest of your hand running. Reset me. Two support for every robot is looking pretty good. Exporting extra tritium is also looking good. But then these are really nice. They're just expensive. Well, this one's nice. I think we're going to be good on trade routes and tritium income, so I'm not super worried about that one, and I'm not super worried about that. I think I will continue to take robot synergies. And I'll come back to that. You can come in here. You can get enabled. I need more tritium. Okay, you can come here, and then I need more power. I think that's going to have to wait until next turn. Are you willing to throw out anything in your hand to take any of these? Fundamentally, no. And then what do you need to do with your hand? You're at six titanium, that's fine for now. It's going to let you build the robot hub, and then you can get more for the gigantic titanium deposit. Your calculus on science is all wrong. You need a, a ton of it. Like, more than is feasible right now, I would say. I'm just trying to figure out if I have any good, like, landing pad sites over here. It doesn't look like it. Maybe we do just grab more titanium, because then we could also get like a... Uh, you should grab power. I think you should do like that. And then you can do like this. And like that, even though it seems crazy. This we're happy to see, but we kind of have to take an ocean project when we see it. Oh god, but there's power here too. Um, we have to take power. We're only at plus seven. That, that's a more important building than anything else there. In my opinion. And then I, I continue to need tritium to fuel this machine. Can't find any. I will grab titanium instead then. And it comes with a nice little science hint too. So, you're getting a robot hub. Farm, soil factory, farm is fine. We can have another double adjacency here. Maybe like thermo generator, resonance station, thermo generator. And then we can have another kind of like triple configuration here. Either way, you can go there. Gigantic tritium for a deep core mine. Or gigantic titanium, large tritium. So now we need to get to nine and nine. That will happen next turn. 
We only need one of you. We can start importing tritium. I really want to get to like 40 science. I, I hate the way that our trade, trade routes work right now. We need more things than our economy can support. I'm blessed by the fact that I can do this, but I hate doing it. We have an enormous amount of trade routes. This should be so easy to do. Right? 30 science, 30 titanium. We're about to have 3 titanium per turn. We can finish it in 10 turns. Yeah, this should be f this should be fine. This should be extremely fine. And then I would love to take a water prods. Oh god, I need to take support to uh take the support. Build the mine. You still need titanium and power. So grab this. And then grab this just for the terraforming parameters. Sure, I didn't expect to get an increase from it, but there you go. And then you can finally have a support building. So we're down to minus 10. I need 6 for you. It'll happen next turn. I can throw one of you out. I can throw all of you out. <laughs> we're not going to build this development center anytime soon. But I think that's okay. I think it's fine. End turn. Titanium asteroid. I don't have the trade routes for you. I'm sorry. You're coming by at the wrong time. Now I can take the cultured meat lab that I wanted. I can build this mine. You're going to need to throw a project out unless you think really carefully about where you explore this turn. Nitrates wouldn't be that bad. You can't reach that, huh? Grab grab water. Grab some water. It comes with a little help, uh, helping of science. And now we can switch this up. So that we do this. And now you need to throw a building out. I think you're okay on trade routes to afford to throw that out. I would really like to get to 10 science to get this cultured meat lab down, though. But I, I that's the way the trade routes have to be right now. You're terraforming parameters, and you're not as far away as I think. But you are plus one science per turn. And you show me more projects. But we're so booked on science right now that there's no realistic hope of us building you. Give me a nitrate hint that also comes with science. Give me a bacteria spread that also comes with support. We're at plus four, minus four. I can't, I can't change it. It's kind of locked in. I hate having to throw something out here. Maybe it is the giant heater. No, you got to keep heat, man. Heat is so hard to get. Maybe it's the development center. Are you willing to gamble on seeing another one before you can afford it? I think so. Or you could throw the CO2 factory out because like your titanium is spoken for for the next 10 turns. You know, you're right. Your titanium is spoken for for the next 10 turns. That building's not going down anytime soon. Take a pine forest. Take a... Do I have any good elevated tiles that I can use you on? No. Like, you're a trap, because you're actually going to be a controlled nuclear meltdown. Not really. I think I just say no to all these to get to 10 science so that I can build you and get two food per turn with a little extra support. And then you can come down here... Give me a little extra power. And now... Now I think we can start thinking about... 
spending power on things that matter. Let's also start working towards a controlled nuclear meltdown. Wow, and we got a marsh out of that somehow? Really? I mean, I'll take it. What do I want to do with that? A nitrate mine? I do just kind of want more stuff. Yeah, let's do a nitrate mine. Force sport. Give me you. Uh, I can explore for titanium next turn. We've got a ton of it up here. Might also want to think about a next city soon. We haven't really filled that blue titanium yet, but I think it's going to fill up fast. End me. I'm still going to keep producing power, so I think Maria makes a lot of sense here. I don't really care about animal spreaders. I can't afford to repair that right now, I'm sorry. You're going to have to wait. Give me... I want titanium and tritium. 15, 16, 17. Okay, let's adjust here very briefly. I want to be able to build this controlled nuclear meltdown next turn. Yeah, just, I, I might honestly let that entire thing auto-repair. And then here, I guess you're pretty close to 10 water. Just grab one of those. You can stick it here, wait for a soil factory to show up. You also need one more titanium for that nitrate mine. Okay, do this. To do this, to do this, for one turn. There's our support increase. We were expecting to see that. That's fine. We're okay with that. I don't think I'm taking any of you right now. But you're coming here. Extra plus one temperature per turn. All of this is getting changed. We're doing something like that. I would love to keep generating more titanium. No, I wanted water, you fool. You needed to explore water. You should have grabbed that. All right, well, that's going to put us back one turn. It's okay. A delivery drone wouldn't be horrible. In... Well, you've got one already, basically. Blue Scopulas wouldn't mind a delivery drone. It's not like the best support building that could go there, but... Maybe it's good enough. We could get an aquifer out of it, get plus one water per turn. I guess I'm fine with that. Would I be willing to wait until you're ready? No, I think you would just send it. Sure, minus one per turn. See if I cry about it. Water project. Give me titanium and water. That's going to give you 10 for this guy. Then you can set this mine up. You have enough left over to repair? No, but maybe. Yes. <laughs> Never in doubt. All right. So, you're progressing nicely. We are at minus 40 per turn. Should probably think about fixing that sometime soon. But I think our, our economy is good. There are a couple places that a city would be pretty nice, like Europe Plains, which really doesn't excite me. But a city up here would be nice. Large titanium, canyon, titanium, water, silicates. That's not bad. You got anything going for you? No. I think we're just chilling and trying to avoid losing for the next couple turns. Like, economy's kind of running itself. Can't complain too much. I think I would rather explore tiles than see more projects. And I really think I would just rather grab support and see what's out here. I'll take the free oxygen increase. I'm not upset about that at all. Having more science... I don't think is my biggest priority right now. Having more trade routes would be okay. A rural community retreat would be okay. Actually, I think blue titanium would, have, would be a really nice community retreat. Because you're going to have two pop and two robots. So you'd be at 22... You'd be 14 support. Well, for 20 power, though. 
20 power. Dang. I think that's maybe not like the worst pick. I don't know when I'm going to put it down, but it's fine. Kind of want to grab both these canyon views when you have the titanium to support it. And then we'll get started on you. Really wish I could take more than one project per turn, for sure. Really got to get this development center down. But I think it's hard to say no to a water project because these two are going to put us at 40, so we can think about our plant spreader. It's fine, it's not amazing. Bump you up a little bit. It feels like we're not accomplishing much. And I'm a little worried about that. I really want to take like four projects here. And I'm not going to be able to, and that blows. Give me a science hint. And then can I get a second science hint from somewhere? You're a science hint that actually just comes with a bunch of other stuff. 14. Next turn you'll be at 18. I want to be at 20 next turn. And I'm willing to trade route to do it. You also lose in four turns, so be a little careful. So what's the best thing to grab here? Possibly a bus station to get both these canyon views. No, you have to take terraforming parameters. You have to. It's basically a free building. You make eight power per turn. And you kind of, like, need to win this scenario eventually. You're going to be a great house, but this is the turn when I can take two projects. So you come in here for sure. You are going to compete with my plant spreader. Like, you're good. No, I think I will still take you. <laughs> yeah, all right, hang on. Hold on. You're done next turn. You're done soon thereafter. We need so many nitrates. It's not even funny. So let's do that. Let's end turn. We can build a plant spreader next turn. And then the turn after that, we can... Actually, we could do it this turn. I don't need that to be done. Next turn, we can grow plants. And then that'll make people happy. And they'll like us more. We'll take another water project and probably a development center. Enable you. Sure. Finish you. Good. And then you come here. We spread... Oh, you need to be warmer? Is that what your problem is? Yeah, you need to be warmer. Uh, well, it's fine, I guess. We do have two other places we can grow. I would love to find a city location up here that's worth settling, but it looks like it's not going to happen because neither of those are very good. I mean, maybe you're not bad. All adjacent locations need to be explored. I just want to know like what the support penalty would be. Oh, I haven't explored that. Okay, fair enough. And then I think Blue Titanium might just get a second robot hub because I want these canyon views. Plus one comfort. Plus one comfort. Minus 84. That's still not great. Dumped park, kind of nice. Android hub, kind of nice. But I have to take power. Take power, take support. And then... Man, I wish I hadn't built you. I think what I could do is I could put a homestead here, and then I can replace you with the domed park. And then I gotta find a place for you, too. You know, you could just go here. But adjacent population provides seven? Oh. Maybe I should found this. Because, like, we can kind of make it happen. It is plus two. You know? 
You know? Yeah. Let's just have this place be a support paradise. So now the homestead is going to come up here too. You'll get nitrate out of it. You'll get titanium out of it. What do you need to expand further? Titanium. Titanium, titanium, titanium. Any big hints of titanium before I jump on a little hint? It looks like no. So grab this guy. You'll be at 6 next turn. I want to be at 10 next turn. I'm going crazy. I'm losing it. And then this can be a domed park. So we'd house, house, and they'll double up on it. House here. I will not lose this game to support. You're going to think I'm crazy. But I'm not the only one. Put me at 20. Give me a water project. And then you're plus one science. So I actually really want to take you, even though you're competing with a development center. Reset these. Finish this. Get to work on that. You come in here. Give me 17 support. It's crazy. We feel great about this. And then I think I would rather have the nitrates. Because I really want to build this thing. Or 8 power. So house, house, house for sure. You can just go here. Excuse me, shouldn't that be extra support? Oh, amount of projects I can research per turn. Was, you need to be this. Okay, there we go. Six science per turn. We'll build you soon. And then I can just take like a, a random bad house? No, thank you. It's possible we play this. I think our science production is about to scale. Sure. Ayo Kunle seems like the kind of guy who would be pretty good with Breach Aquifer right about now. Especially because Craig doesn't really do anything for terraforming parameters. And I think from here on out, we basically only take stuff that terraforms. I know it might seem like it's a little early to make that pivot. But I think we can afford to. And you get double explorations. That's so good right now. I don't think you even know how good that is right now. What did you think you could build here? A mine? Why? You didn't get any titanium. Uh, I need a robot hub here too. I need more titanium. Let's take one turn off from this water project. And just kind of get this taken care of. Because I need like Android hub to go here, here, here. I wouldn't mind setting this volcano off, too. It's free terraforming parameters. I can just repair the mine later. I mean, we're a ways off on the tritium, but we can get it. End of my turn. I'll come back and look at you in a bit. Enable you. Get you out of here. Come here. Guided tours. Come here. Mine. Come here empty tile that we can use for stuff later you need titanium to build that nitrate mine and power it's not going to happen so instead grab nitrates to start working towards your whatchama you know your your thingamajig your bio your bio plant your bio generator that's the one and then maybe put a research center down too just so you can see some projects and stuff so I need six for you. We're getting eight per turn. So I can do that and we'll be at six. I can do this and we'll be at six. I can do this and we'll be at six. And then I'll bin some silicates. No, I shouldn't. I should build that resonance station. I can bin food. And then I can import Oh, I'm going to change this up one more time. I can do this. Then I can build the resonance station next turn. I can do this. And I can build a tritium thermo generator next turn. And then, like, our power should be squared away. 
And then give me terraforming parameters, give me plus one science per turn, and give me a project that I might conceivably do. I'll look at you in a bit. You come here. You come here. 14 power per turn. I don't know what I want you to be. Which means I don't think I want you to be anything. Give me terraforming parameters. Give me a mine. Give me projects. Space projects. And then give me nitrate. I can only do one nitrate. Does that mean it makes more sense for me to breach an aquifer this turn? I already used a skill this turn. Can I afford to breach you? Your mine is 8 power to 20 water. I can. I can afford to do that. That's fine. Oh, but then I didn't build this mine. That's okay. I'll get it next turn. And now I can research a project. Uh, your terraforming parameters. You're not bad. I don't think I need import tritium right now. I'll take you. I might throw you out. And then just give me one science for my trouble. Minus 70. I think I'm unconcerned. If you do this, you can't explore this turn. Are you okay with that? No, because I think I kind of want to get nitrates this turn. Pit mine. Explore here. Explore here. I would happily take a rover museum, I think. And then we can reset all these. I think I would take this off to finish power. Just skip a turn on that. Now, what do any of you do? Hyperloop, pretty good. But I really need more plant spreaders. I need to get ox... Oh, I have one in hand. Never mind. And you have two support buildings already. I need to get, like, a house to play. A house would be good. Maybe give me a Hyperloop? Where are you going to use it? I, blue Titanium can grab a lot with a Hyperloop. You've got a canyon. You've got a gigantic aquifer. Yeah, I think that makes sense. Do I need a support building anywhere? No. No. Definitely not. No. So we can skip the school. Maybe I would just take another plant spreader. We make five nitrates per turn. We could make even more. There's a gigantic nitrates deposit up here if I could get like a train station that's one, two, three, four away. I just need to make sure that I'm living. What am I behind on right now? Oxygen. So oxygen needs to go down. And then I think I would rather play a development center. You can go here. I can play a plant spreader. I think that's more important than a biogenerator. And then the next time I have enough nitrates, the biogenerator will be more important. I think I want to continue hammering on nitrate. Give me four. Give me extra science. Satellite me on to... Maybe tritium to set that volcano off? Sure, give me five of you. I could just put you down anywhere I want. Five support, little science. Little tasty hint of science. And then start working on extra power. No, I think you need to flood the planet a little more. Now, what do you want in here? A bus station's fine. Gas factory's fine. I don't think I care about any of the rest of this stuff. The worst house ever? I would... You know what? I would play the worst house ever. Because even the worst house ever... 
is going to get me six support, and like either of these spots will be better. Plus I get an expansion out of that, which would get me a silicate at the cost of minus one pleasedness. Give me a house, give me terraforming, give me science, build me a mine, give me nitrate, give me nitrate. 21. We're like halfway there. Support is getting a little scary here though. I'm going to need to build a Marsha soon, I think, which is going to involve saving a little titanium. We're going to be at 7 next turn. I need to be at 5. Well, you would do that then. And then you'd do some of that. You're also getting close to being able to turn on the volcano. But just you got to you got to be a little careful here. Cuz people are getting mad. And your terraforming parameters are a long ways away from helping. In fact, you may almost want to breach an aquifer next turn to, to tick it over. Maybe this guy. He's cheap. Yeah, yeah, you know what? I think I am going to next turn. Alright, send it. I will happily take extra support. I might not even need to do that now. And then this is the point where we throw you out and we bring you in. Your extra support, basically for free. And then a train station is huge. I'll come back to New London. Get rid of this rock. Give me plus one science per turn. Explore. Can I find cheap nitrate? I can. Four and four. And then build your Marsha here. 17 support. This is chillin'. Turn this back on. You have one more expansion that you can use now? Are you any good? No. Grab an empty tile. Look at whether you can put an alpine pine forest anywhere. You need one heat, one water. I don't... You could. You could put one in Arabia Major. Would it give you a, support, a threshold? Yes, it would. Then I think you need to build one. This will make people happy. 76. Okay. It also gives you oxygen, which is positive. So now we live long enough for heat increase, probably for an oxygen increase and for an atmosphere increase, and everything is really ticking along. I think we can safely skip these last couple. We should probably think about founding a new city at some point. Our existing cities are starting to fill up. You're a plains, but you're not bad. You're empty. You're going to be a great shipwright location. You have a titanium available and a lot of empty tiles. Plus, you're in a place with a forest and people like that. End my turn. Give me seagrass, because we're about to run out of plants that we can plant. Gas factory is free terraforming parameters. Ignore the rest for now. Turn you on. 18 power per turn. Rush this water project. Next turn, I am going to found you. So can I have two cheap explorations? Uh, doesn't get any better than two and two that also come with nitrates. Then that gives you a train station. Do you want a train station blue titanium? It's not as good now that you got rid of that water deposit. You could also train station New London. Two, three. It would get you the nitrate that you wanted. I think I will. 
one. It also gets rid of like some unhappiness. I'm still gonna do it, man. I don't I don't care. I'm crazy. And then we have a couple empty tiles. This rock is going to be a hospital just to get a little extra support out of it. And then can I satellite a big hint of titanium or uh, tritium somewhere? No. Then give me a small hint that also has nitrates attached to it. I might not take any of these. Well, actually, an applied science center isn't horrible. I guess robots also aren't horrible. And then I can finally play artificial personality. So building robots makes people happier now by one. Okay. Feeling, feeling all right. 40 nitrates is amazing. <laughs> it's so good. And then increase food, water, or nitrates to get support. Ocean tiles give support. Increase science or silicates. Cheaper space projects is kind of good. And science production increases every time we build a development center. Yeah, I think Technologies BU is going to end up being better. I refuse to repair that. I'll take you, because I actually have space for you. You go here. 20 power. I don't think I've ever produced 20 power per turn in a game before. Harvest you. Dump you on the poles. And I need titanium for you. No. Just give me nitrates instead. Alright. Destroy you. Support. New London. Basically done. Come over here. Found a city. Plus three isn't amazing, but we're going to be able to build it up. You're going to get a robot hub. You'll probably get a bus station. Anyone else in here? Three science is six support per turn. Once we have an ocean. Hard to say no to that. And then I also would take you and I would throw out like one of these guys. Or now you'll you're gonna have the opportunity to build a giant heater this turn, I believe. I think I I think I don't need space roots anymore. Like I know it gives plus one comfort of living, I just don't think I care. Minus 84, that's fine. It's okay. Give me a little extra support. That puts us at two. We need like 70 more water. And heat is a problem. Heat in 30 turns. We need to build heat up. The rest of these? Well, actually, we're not even at oxygen or atmosphere two yet. We might have a problem on those. We'll see. So these are really cheap explorations now. Give me this, give me this, just because they're nearby. These are also really cheap now. And then this is pretty cheap. Give me a titanium, give me a tritium. Nah, I'd rather let that flood. Give me an empty tile. And then you also have a random eight science left over. Let's put that there, we'll get more projects faster. Wouldn't mind taking a house, but you have one in hand already, so it's not the end of the world. Wouldn't mind taking a domed park for the new city you just built. Wouldn't mind taking 30 heat. That is just completely space project blind to that. Very nearly missed it. <laughs> Drilling seems like the kind of thing that would be very good. I think it's a little late for Deja. How many of these conceivably do I have left to do? Not many. And I would love to have atmosphere. And I would love to have a water project. Somebody's gotta go. I guess it's you. Just to take the better water project. I can't afford the nitrates right now on a soil factory. I have better nitrate buildings 
to construct than that. I will take a robot hub. I will turn you in. I will build you. Set up a mine. I would actually like to drill... I should, I should explore. Grab your really cheap explorations first. To get the atmosphere out of it. And then that's a pretty cheap gas factory for atmosphere. So the timer on atmosphere is almost almost sorted. We would be done at turn 67. We just need to accelerate that by a little bit. I think plant spreaders naturally coming off cooldown are going to be enough to do it. If I can find a single nitrate with this satellite, I will also be ready to put down the biogas generator, which is going to go... Oh, I used all those spots already. Which is going to go... People don't hate living next to it, which means that it could go here. Did I build a resonance station anywhere else and I'm just forgetting it? Nope. But I really want to play it this turn. You're a good city. You're like a building spot. I don't want to take you up. Can't destroy that rock. You're never going to be a soil factory. Just give up on that idea. Heat also needs to get accelerated a little bit here, but I think the Giant Space Mears project is going to help. And then what am I doing with trade rates? Are we good here? Yes, I want to finish that 40 nitrate project. It'll let me build another plant spreader as soon as it's done. We have a ton of ocean that we can spread plants into. We're also looking at putting down a giant heater relatively soon. I think it would go really well in Xanthi. Maybe, no, not Promethea. No, no, not Promethea. It doesn't get enough rain. Maybe lower Nuachas if I can make it over there. Maybe, you know, maybe Tantalus. You're done next year. Okay, just end your turn. I think you're fine. Bee colony. I don't have three temperature anywhere. Magnetic fusion plant? No, thank you. Gene vault? Maybe. Terraforming parameters? God, I need to take these. I need a fourth space project slot. You're definitely coming with me. You're coming with me. I think the rest of these are staying, but I hate it. So we do this. We do this. We do this. This. You come here. Give me free atmosphere, please. Where's the cheapest I can get it? Eh, six is fine. And then New London is like plant spread or central, so I think you're going to get a gene ball. I just want to fire these as often as possible. We'll also try and build an animal spreader in here somewhere. We'll try and build another plant spreader in there somewhere as soon as we have the nitrates. And though it pains me, I think I have to throw you out. I'm saving my silicates for the dome. Well, you know, we might end up playing you. Okay. Marsquake is a little unfortunate. I don't have the titanium to repair that because I blew it all on that space project. We are down 20 support on just random destroyed buildings right now. But that's fine. Let's keep atmosphere going. Atmosphere is now done. Atmosphere will be finished at 63. Don't have to worry about that. Give me a free science per turn. Oh, I need to increase my pop. I need titanium so badly. I should have drilled for titanium this turn. I think I've, I've like, cost myself a turn that I didn't need to spend. Which is annoying. I did. You can get in. Well, actually, maybe I didn't. 
because I can take a house. Who still needs a house? Somebody still needs a house. Blue Scorpius does. You can be a house. Vineyards. Three temperature, one rainfall. I don't think that's true anywhere on the planet right now. It's not. And it won't be for 20 turns. So heat is also done. No, it's not done. It'll be done at 73. That's wrong. Don't research any more of those. You come in here. Give me a canyon view. Next turn we'll build that. Next turn is going to matter. Make sure you do it carefully. I want to save Tritium to try and set off this volcano. Okay, end turn, and now just let me, let me think. Take shrubs. Atmosphere's done. You don't have to take atmosphere anymore. Just don't touch it. Don't worry about food. First of all, power. You can set up a giant heater here. It's going to accelerate your heat. That's good. You like that. Second, you could repair this. It's free. Good. Third, if you drill tritium, you could set this volcano off. Which would advance your heat, along with giant space mirrors. I think it would mean that heat is done. Is that worth doing? I don't know. You also have to expand your pop here, which you could do with a robot hub. So that you could put down a... A science thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you like this. This also gives you support. And then you do this, you do this. So you like that for sure. You could think about getting a mine out of it and an empty tile. If you can find a hint of titanium, you could even build that mine this turn. Sure, grab it. Since atmosphere is done... I think I would rather mine resources with Arthur. Like, I don't need to explore anymore. It's costing me power for no reason. So if that's true, what do you want to mine for? I, titanium, obviously. You don't even have to think about that. 12 titanium for one power. Yeah, that seems like a good deal. And then this is free. Oh, but you don't need it. It doesn't matter. Uh, I don't think you need any of it. Maybe take a landing pad. So you're gone. You don't you don't matter anymore. I also think these are about to not matter anymore. We can basically get like a free trade route though, which is pretty good. It lets us rush through that faster. This is water done. We'll be at 128 out of 102, which means that I think setting off the volcano won't matter. I just have to see what the timer looks like after we finish Space Mirrors. So all that we should have to worry about is not losing and water. Is not, or not losing and oxygen. Oxygen's done in 15. It'll be done on 70. That's not quite good enough. So you're going to need to take support buildings to outlast. You're just going to flood. You don't matter. Leave it. You don't actually have to spend it. Uh, and then you're drilling tritium basically every turn from now on so that you can finish both of these. You're done next turn. That's good. And I want to wait on these to see if they're actually necessary in that case.
Tharsis, I can't help but feel would agree with an android hub. Oh, it's full. Yeah, you can't put anything there anymore. That means blue titanium should probably think about getting a hyperloop. You live for three turns. But I think maybe there'll be some math in there, like an animal spreader. We do have a water mine that we can drill. People like animals. A plant spreader. Good. Probably a little late. And then what are we going to heat? Let's heat Samaria Minor because we can grow plants there. Spreaders always go in New London. Double heat. Single water. Nowhere currently. Seagrass me in Tantalus. Seagrass me in Lower Arabia. Plus 60 support. Then, we gotta move through these. We need 50 tritium. We have 32. What else did you want to drill? You wanted to drill water to try and get an animal spreader down. That seems maybe a little ambitious. Because you'd get 10, 20, 30. It'd take you three turns to get an animal spreader down. You might still be alive. If you also, like, satellite at a couple hints of water, eh, yeah, maybe it would work. Just maybe it would work. Also, if you, like, built a house somewhere in there, maybe you'd be fine. I don't have the space projects to finish you right now. I just don't have the capacity for it. Oh, and then your heat. Uh, yes, your heat is going to be done. You can throw both these out. You don't need to take heat or atmosphere anymore. I actually think we might need to satellite support. 50% science per turn? Sure, it doesn't matter. We don't need you. Take you. Take you. Take you, your sport. If we get that desperate. Spreading bacteria is going to be nice. We definitely want to spread O2. That takes us from 10 to 9. We'll be done at 66. We're so close. We're so close to being good on the timer. So you go here. I need to satellite water. I need a big hint of water. I would spend six... No, you wouldn't do that. You'd drill for ten. If you need water, you would drill. Because it's more water than anything else. And then you satellite here, you'll get at least four. You can put an animal spreader down. You can spread animals. People are like, holy shit, rabbits. That's crazy. Plus 40 support. Have you changed your timer? You live for two turns? You haven't changed your timer much. Rabbits are up in three turns, though. Bacteria 17. Uh, those plant spreaders might come up in time. It's going to be close, but they might come up in time. And then give me an applied science center, because if we see uh, high-tech luxuries, that might be the kind of thing that saves your life. Give me a second animal spreader. Also give me a spaceport. It's basically free. Also give me a house. It's support. Who still has room for houses? Not you. You do. Plus seven. It's so scuffed. Can I put you anywhere that gives me support? Sort of. This bacteria spreader is never going to fire again, so actually, yes. You'll be done next turn. That's not going to be enough to push our water threshold over, though. And then I actually think you need to explore a support node. We need to get over 300, so you need to explore support nodes with your next two turns. 
Or I could just build a shitload of robots. 10 and 10. You can afford it. This is going to be really close. <laughs> like, really, really close. Who boy. I don't immediately think any of these do anything for us. Although maybe a bacteria spreader does. I kind of need high-tech luxuries to live. I need you to be able to spread anywhere. Lower Samaria should be hot, right? It has to be a support node to them. Let's go. You can go here. It gives us extra support. We need to now get 280. You're not going to matter. Just be, be seagrass. Oh my god, we can't put seagrass anywhere either. Um, ah, yeah, this will work. Oxygen is still a six turn clock. I don't love that. You're off cooldown in eight turns. You will never fire again. You will be a bacteria spreader instead. And we will spread oxygen bacteria. Five turns. If we can find a way to live for five turns. If such a thing is possible. Nine plus fourteen will put us at twenty-three. I need more trade routes to show up in like the next turn or two. I also just need to put down robots anywhere I have building space. Which is gonna be blue titanium, it looks like. Oh, there's room for a house here too. Also, we're dangerously close to this increasing next turn. I think that we might be in serious trouble. I think that we might be in a rough spot. Yeah, there it is. Oh, but my oxygen increases. All right, so we're alive for one more turn. Give me another bacteria spreader, I guess. Minimum requirements, two oxygen. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Throw the rest out. Give me animals. Can you make people happy if I spread you in a place that like has a city or something? Yes. You should go here, then. I need to get to 450. We need to explore support the smiley faces. And then you fire in four turns, you fire in three, you fire in four. Your heat parameter now, because you increase heat per turn. You don't need the titanium mine. That's not a play you're going to see every day. <laughs> Give me this here. Oh, I just need to live for four turns, man. Can it be done? Keep building robots. They give support. Like, every single number matters right now. Reaching that canyon view seems a little dicey. Next turn, I might need to build a hyperloop to get that canyon view. I also would love seeing a house. I also would love seeing extra trade routes. 15, 25. I might need to... No, 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 no. I can change this. I can go a little bit more. Okay, now we'll be at 17. And then if I drill next turn, I should have enough. That'll put us at water three. And we should be okay. Flora, you're actually maybe not late to the party. 
because you do give support for exploring. That animal spreader will not show up. We we can't generate the no, the amount of water required. So give me a development center. And give me six science. If we see high tech luxury show up next turn, we're really excited. Give me a hyperloop. So that I can grab this canyon view, that support. You need to explore support. Anything to keep that going. And then do I have any zone that has double oxygen right now? You have Amazonas. You you do have the tiles to get into Amazonas. You need a you need a I need to replace the train station with a maglev. Oh, but I explored. Okay, well, we might have screwed ourselves. What else is new? Sure. I need one more. Oh, I never built you. We're short. That could be pretty bad. No, because heat will increase next turn. And the turn that it increases on counts. We've learned this before. I think we're good. I think... I think we're good. I think we're good. I hope we're good. Let me rephrase. Okay, that's pretty bad. High tech luxury is pretty good though. Um, so let me let me think. We're not going to be good. We're actually going to lose. <laughs> oh no. Can I get 25 science this turn? We actually lost by one trade route. We actually lost by a single trade route. There's no way I can get 300 support out of this. Because next turn, temperature, atmosphere, and water all increase. Well, let's... Not totally... Do we have a house we can take? You got a skyscraper. You can't take it, though. It's too expensive. Am I sure I wish to end my turn? Oh, man. Yeah, I'm sure I wish to end my turn. Oh, never mind, it counts. We talked about this. Holy cow. <laughs> okay. Okay. We've covered this before. It counts the last turn. I, I panicked for no reason, and I'd like to apologize. Enable you. Truly, I just want the support. <laughs> just get me out of here, man. I gotta, I gotta leave this game. Just plant me a, a pine forest, sure. Yeah, this is fine. No trade routes, yeah, it's fine. Uh, oxygen increases next turn. Get out of here. Holy cow, man. Oh, well, that's Blue Planet done. It's not like I was stressed or anything about it. It's actually, like, really easy and under control the whole time. So, there is now uh, one game left. And if you've been watching this series from the start, maybe you're not that surprised that it's Red Path. Because historically, Red Path has been pretty hard for us. But everything else right now has that little uh, that red seal of approval. So, I will see you back here at my earliest convenience to try and wrap up Red Path 45. 
we will purchase the DLC because I never bothered. We'll do like one DLC game, maybe the weekly challenge, something like that. And then we're going to put Terraformers to bed. So I will see you around for that. But until then, take care. Enjoy the rest of your day.